Hey guys, it's Kanji once again with another exciting World Collectible update. And as you will see, finally, it has arrived. The Shishibukai Conference Table, WCF Party, Ichiban Kuji. We've got it, and it's rocking. I mean, just check it out. Look at the details. So let's go through these figures once as we go. So, first of all, you've got the awesome Dracul Mihawk. Um, who comes with his blade, I can't remember off the top of my head what it's called, but it's phenomenally huge standing there behind him. And it comes with its own little stand. And yeah, I love the detail on uh, Mihawk's hat, the plumage there, and uh, the way that he's just sitting there cross-legged looking pretty pretty awesome with a, a glass of wine in front of him. Pretty sick. I mean, then we've got uh, Bartholomew Mukuma there, arms folded, not looking too happy. Look at that grumpy face. But yeah, look at the paint detail just on his hat. And I love the finish on the hair. And um, again, you know, sitting on the chair there, um, pretty cool. Definitely one of my favourites there in the middle. You've got um, Gekko Maria with his legs up, not happy at all, bandaged up on his head, presumably after his battle with Luffy on Thriller Bark. Um, again, amazing paintwork, really nice detail. Um, you know, all the ruffles there on his his neck and um, you know his hands, like arms folded, and his sleeves. You know, and the orange on his pants is just so sweet. Um, then, you know, black beard, and as you can see behind, I've also got you know the black beard from the um, special request set. Uh, but yeah, this black beard, eating a nice piece of. I guess cherry pie or something like that with um, uh, a um, glass of grog or something in his hand looks pretty sweet um, and then of course the um, the brilliant Do Flamingo there sitting reading a blank sheet of paper um, presumably like some news or some information from the um, from the government about the uh, the upcoming execution of Ace because obviously this was the call to arms for the Shishubukai just before the um, the Battle of Marine Ford started. So uh, and then of course you've got a little Suru there, the only um, Marine in this set. Um, so yeah, a really awesome set, um, really good price as well, considering the table itself is quite a rare lottery item. Um, so yeah, I was really pleased to have picked up all of those for about five thousand yen. Um, not really anything else added in the main Marine Ford display case. Um, still waiting for some new stuff to arrive. Um, some very interesting updates here. So obviously you can see their boxes there for the Ichiban Kuji um, uh, Shishukai conference table set. And of course the box here for the uh, table itself. And here um, there's a few Marines that still haven't been unboxed and of course the redhead pirates. I've, I've rebooked Shanks for the time being and uh, this Finally arrived and would you believe it was a bootleg? Yes, a bootleg So I've managed to get my refund um, absolutely Not happy at all about that um, And absolutely shocking. I mean, uh, let's look at this see this now look i am usually pretty good when it comes to figures um i'm usually really careful where i order them from typically i always get everything from direct from japan but i was so desperate for this yasop figure that i uh, made the mistake of ordering it um from some random ebay buyer with very poor um kind of uh, numbers basically uh, and look at the state of this Get in focus. Get in focus. Look at that. It's absolutely shocking. Cheap plastic. Some Chinese bootleg. Uh, the, the, the printing on the face is all completely wrong. The eyes in the wrong place. Uh, it came with a shoddy base. Comes in this crappy plastic bag. And uh, the actual box itself. It's got no golden Tui sticker on it, and it's all crushed and ripped. It actually didn't even come in it well. The whole box was flattened, basically, as it came in the mail, and it wasn't even like packaged well. It just came in a jiffy bag. So yeah, I mean, 
I have ordered another Yasop um, direct from Japan this time. It's going to cost me a little bit more. Um, at least I got a refund on that. But you know, I absolutely abhor bootlegs, and I mean that is probably only the second bootleg I've ever ended up with by accident in ten years. Um, since I think my portrait of Pirates Luffy when I was very green. So yeah, you can just imagine how upset I was when I opened that in the mail. So anyway, do a couple of other things. So parcel has arrived today. And so you will see here, I finally have a full body from Marines um, volume one. So I will put him here for now. And obviously I have got Hina um, and Django and the transponder snail coming soon um, with all the Den Den Mushy. So they'll be fitting in those gaps there. Um, and I've of course got the remaining Shichibukai. So I mean I've just picked up the ones around the, the, uh, the conference table. But um, I've also got these volume 4 ones. So as you can see, you know, as far as uh, Marine Ford goes, you know, I've kind of stuck with um, most of the Marine Ford kind of design, so I've skipped on on Crocodile. I ended up with the Ichiban Kuji of, of Jinbei. This, of course, is Kuma, um, so check out my next review to see how he looks unboxed. Uh, equally, Gekka Maria. I've got the Ichiban Kuji Flamingo, who you've already seen. Um, obviously, the, the recolor version. And, of course, Mihawk will be part of this display. Um, Boa Hancock, I have gone for the lovely purple dress version. Um, and, obviously, Blackbeard, that's kind of his gyre appearance. Um, whereas I have two Blackbeards now from kind of Impel Down, Stroke, Marine Ford. So, yeah, so that's really exciting stuff. And then the last thing I really just wanted to talk about was a few upcoming sets. So, obviously, I'm really excited about... Um, some of the upcoming sets such as Whole Cake Island um, and obviously Mugiwara 56 and stuff but what I'm most excited about at the moment is none other than these very awesome Ichiban Kuji Limited Versus figures so correct me if I'm wrong but I believe Weekly Shonen Jump 34 um, gave some kind of lottery coupons or entry coupons um, to basically purchase these um, kind of uh, anniversary, 50th anniversary weekly Shonen Jump um, figures. It extends beyond just One Piece. I think there's like a My Hero Academia and a few other ones um, that are available. But of course, it's really the, the um, One Piece stuff I'm interested in. So of course, I mean, look at that category. There's already... A category coming obviously in volume um volume three of whole cake island but not one with the mochi mochi powers um like that that is just phenomenal and then to make things even more exciting we have none other than this i mean check that out that is Gear 4 Luffy, Snake Man. And so for those of you who haven't read the manga yet, I mean, this is a new um, transformation for, for Luffy. Um, I mean, look at the hair. He, he just looks so cool. And to have this pose with that category, it's just going to be amazing. So yeah, really excited about that. And then uh, for those who are interested, there is also a Zoro figure. So that is pretty amazing. And I mean, we've had a kind of fight set with Zoro and Sanji before, but this one I just think is um, is just amazing. I mean, look at the detail. I don't know whether the final figure will turn out as good. Um, I'd like to think it will, but yeah, it's just incredible. And finally, of course, we have Sanji coming. And yeah, that flaming kick, um, angry looking Sanji there. And uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm just really excited about these new figures and they come out in December. Um, so they'll probably go here in my Whole Cake Island. I've got them already pre-ordered 
through um, Rakuten. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for today, guys. Um, I hope you've enjoyed and uh, keep collecting. Bye.